Right then, I've gone all the way over to Kingston to ride Optair, the bus. One of the best buses in London. They used to run on the 360 route from Elephant to Royal Albert Hall, and a couple of years ago, they got rid of it. This is a totally awesome bus, and it's a one-off prototype, and it was introduced as part of the London's hybrid bus trials. This is a one-off, completely unique Optair hybrid using the Siemens hybrid system. It sounds absolutely amazing, and it's got an epic number plate, op 7 are aka Optair, the bus. And a couple of weeks ago, over in Kingston, it started running again. Yes! So I went all the way over to Kingston to ride it. I checked that it was running today using my bus find app, which I made. And I got over there and it disappeared from the bus find app. And I asked one of the drivers when it was coming back and he looked out for me and said it would be coming back at four o'clock. So I waited for it and it didn't turn up because it had broken down. Later on in the day, I saw a bus go past. And it was being test driven by one of the drivers to check it was working. So it didn't go back into service, which was really annoying. So then with that disappointment of not being able to get on up to have a bus, let's go ride a lift. And here is something I've never actually seen before. Before. Over in this building, which is called Rotunda next to Kingston bus station, there is an Otis 2000 hydraulic. Quite cheap, really cheap range of Otis 2000, typical wrapped hydraulic where lift gets pulled up from the sides. And it's now been modernised into a Gen 2. Now, this is what's interesting, because I've never actually seen anything quite like this before. They haven't changed the lift car itself. They've just changed the hydraulic ram, got rid of that, replaced it with an Otis Gen 2 motor and belt cable system. Now, not much has changed for a lift car, really. It's still the same lift car, and it's still pulled in the same way as it used to be pulled when it was a hydraulic, which is from the side. Just take a look at these belt cables. So here we have the Otis Gen 2 belt cables, 2 to 1 cabling. Except it goes down from the ceiling over on the right hand side, down through the counterweight, back up to the Gen 2 motor, down to the lift, which so far so good. Then through a pulley wheel on the lift, then straight back up on the right hand side, back up to the ceiling again. So the entire mechanism is pulling the lift up from the side, just like it did when it was hydraulic. That's really weird because it means the entire lift is just pulled in a really odd way. And it doesn't go up fast, it just goes the same speed as it did when it was hydraulic. That's because the same lift car, pretty much operating the same way really, apart from the fact they've changed the mechanism that runs it so the lift car is only designed to go two thirds of a meter a second and since they graded it to a gen 2 it still only goes two thirds of a meter a second this is so weird let's ride it <laughs> Thank you. 